Hello and welcome to our channel. It's the Vigil of God in 717 and I am here today to do an extended reading off of our second channel. Daily message. Thank you guys so much. If you guys are part of Patreon, the 144K chat membership reading is up. Make sure you guys check it out after both of the premieres and the extended, okay? That reading was hot, okay? It's called What Are They Hiding? It's a new one that I am doing, okay? So I need you guys to check that out, all right? This reading here is, um, it's in a confession that's overdue, okay? It's a lot uh, that has been hidden from you. And the crazy part is that this person is, um, somebody's going through a, ser a serious world awakening, okay? They're going through an ego death. Everything is spiraling out of control in their life. Everything they thought was real is not. It's ending. It's crumbling. And this person has been holding back from you a lot of things that um, they were wearing a different face with you. Mm -hmm. This person is uh, effed up over you and they are very paranoid about a goodbye. That you're going to say goodbye to them after they tell you, after you know the truth, the, hundred, the raw truth. Mm-hmm. Unspoken truth has been hidden from you. Um, you guys may know pieces of it. Lord God may have been giving you messages in your dreams and things like that. But you are about to find out the truth about a situation. This person wants to be, have a fresh start with you and confess, profess their love to you as well. But you guys may be uh, wondering what, what, or what they're up to because this person was always shady. Mm -hmm. They're having a hard time. Whoever this is is drinking a lot. They're trying to cope. Mm -hmm. they, they're going through some serious betrayals here too. Uh, when it comes to finding out who true pe who people truly are. This person had a lot of things that you did not know about them. Mm -mm. No. Mm. Okay, let's get, let's get into this. So we got, and you guys can be divine partners. If you're not twin flames, you, you're definitely a divine par partnership, okay? We got twin flames and spiritual warfare, okay? So this was a lesson. Whatever this was, hit this person prolonged the lesson. This is a lesson that was supposed to have been learned so that they can move forward with you guys. Um, this person was um, prolonging something here. And the ending is faded. So whatever they were running from is going to end the way God designed it anyway. So this, they made a mess of something here that did not have to be this bad. Effed up over you and goodbye. Okay? So this person's afraid that you're going to say goodbye to them after you hear this or know the truth. Okay? After this is revealed. And they're in their head heavy. This person is like, whew, unstable. We have um, fresh start, moving, buying a house, selling a house, new city, state, career change, left a toxic relationship, fresh start, okay? And we have um, side eye apology, unsure motives, okay? So you guys are going to be very unsure about what this person is coming towards you for, okay? Um, that does, that, that means the trust was broken here. Yeah. We got cope best friend partner and crying covers for them okay so somebody that they knew or um trusted has crossed them in some type of way yeah because that's legal matters here when it comes to sex directly with sex and love so whatever this is this is something heavy okay we have divorce property criminal paternity child support traffic tickets we got some crime stuff going on here some underhanded things that you guys did not know about this person some things they were doing behind the scenes this person was like dr jekyll and mr Hyde type of energy who you thought they were they had you had no idea uh but this wing man Whoever they saw as a partner in crime covers for them, male or female, take it how it resonates, who they left you for, or a best friend, or a friend of me, or whoever they were dealing with here. Um, it's leading to, to legal matters. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be public. This person was trying to hide this. They never wanted you to see this, but there's something coming up. This, this living in the moment type of energy here. Uh, firestorm living in the moment. This is bringing somebody some heavy karma. So this person was hiding this wild. They were living a wild life behind your back. There was a lot about this person you had no idea about. Mm -hmm. And turning your back. This person's afraid you're going to turn your back. You guys got two options of love when it comes to love here. You guys are walking towards a new beginning. So you're going to have to make a decision. 
Yep, to say goodbye to something. Either the new boo or the person that's coming in towards you, but you got to choose. That's crazy. Whatever they went towards was not a, it was not a uh, victory. No, it wasn't. What is the side eye here? Yep. This person's entrapped in their head and the eight of swords. Mm-hmm. They're stuck on you. This person is, um, and they're also entrapped in their head about what you're going to say. How you're going to respond to them, if you're going to believe them, if you're going to trust what they're saying is the truth. Because this person lied a lot. Mm -hmm. This person has been very deceptive in the past. And they're stuck in their head right now about what you're going to say and how you're going to do. Some of them could be in jail already or in jail and trying to and want to come towards you, want a fresh start with you. But they are um, trying to figure out how to come towards you. Mm -hmm. What's wingman? Lies. This person was lying to you. So this this is the, if there's a best friend or a partner in crime or somebody that cover for them, they, they they were lying to you about the connection with this person. The Knight of Swords in reverse. Mm -hmm. This they were lying to you about this connection. There was more to this connection with this person, and they were li they were not honest about it. Uh uh. No, they were not. So I'm blowing up here. What's reckless love here? I haven't used this deck in a while. Mm -hmm. A tower. Reckless sex. Legal matters. This person, something about to go down in the court system when it comes to um, some type of sexual energy here. Yeah, a tower is blowing when it comes to reckless sex. This is about to be something else here. This person got themselves in some type of jam. Mm-hmm. And they've been getting away. This person been getting away with whatever this is for a while. But they, like, they've been pushing back. They were delaying situations and it's fated to happen. When Lord God's like I tell you guys all the time, when people do spell work and all that other stuff, anything you do to to, to um to delay Lord God's design is gonna still come back, but it's coming back heavier on you when it comes to the punishment and the consequences. So it's not worth it. This person here, they took the long route just to come right back, but this time it's gonna end worse. It's gonna be more embarrassing. It's gonna be something that it could not have been. If this person was just honest about it or whatever this was or dealt with it or got a hold of it or got, got it under control, whatever this is that's coming towards you, this would not have ended this way. Yep. This would not have ended this way. The tower's blowing. Yep. What's this karma? Firestorm. Betrayal. Yep. Everything is okay. Everything is fine. No, it's not. I want clear energy. What's the what's the karma here? What is karma, Father? Yep. Queen of Swords in reverse. Living in the past. Betrayal. A lie. All the lies are being revealed with this firestorm. Karma. All types of drama. Everything. All lies are coming out. Somebody's having a mental loss, mental breakdown here. They're losing their self. This person is um, dealing with some narcissistic energies around them. There's a lot of karma coming back with the Wheel of Fortune. So this person, whatever lifestyle that they were living outside of you is now about to be exposed. The Queen of Swords in reverse, that could be somebody that they were dealing with that is, is bringing this to a head. This person was their karma. This person brought up, this person has started igniting a serious fire here with the Queen of Swords. This is an evil, evil, evil bee. This person is mean. Don't care. Very destructive here. Mm-hmm. What is Nubu? Victory. Yep. You guys got to live. This is third party connect. I told you guys this is going to be a third party situation. You guys got to let go of somebody and turn your back on someone. But either way it goes, whichever direction that you choose will be a victory for you. Mm-hmm. What is Nubu? Yeah, Wheel of Fortune. What goes around comes around. This person is maybe about to lose you. That's why I said in the reading, in the title, will this be the final nail in the coffin? Some of you got some of you guys may be turning your back after you hear all the truth about the situation here. 
This may just be this person's karma, will of fortune, because there's something that happened here. This is some what goes around, comes around a situation which lets me know that there's something that happened here between you and this person. And it has to do with the Eight of Swords. This person could have been trying to set you up or turn the way that they handle things with the people around and they believe different things about you. They went towards different things because of them trying to hurt you. Their focus was to hurt you, keep you stuck, make you feel like that you um, are not worthy. Um, but in reality, this person was in love with you the whole time. They were trying to destroy you. Okay, if you guys are twin flames, it set off some serious spiritual warfare for this person. That's why they're going through a serious. This person was ego driven. It was all about control, and whatever they can hide from you, they were happy to keep that away. They were willing to treat you like crap and mistreat you and hurt you to keep you away. They had a very sick, twisted, demented way of thinking, and it's blowing up in this person's face now. Yeah, fresh start. This person wants to come towards you and have and rush in towards you and the king of wands to take control of the situation. Mm-hmm. What well, is cold here? They're having a hard time. This person's having a very hard time with well, how they did you. Yeah. This person did not value you. They 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 tried to devalue you. This person did a lot of things to cross you. They crossed you because due to lies when it comes to the, whoever this best friend or partner in crime is. This person did not want you to know the truth about this connection with this person and what they were doing behind the scenes, behind your back. These two could have been in cahoots and doing something against you and keeping you trapped up in your head. Some type of plan that they had worked together with this person. And now this person is trying to cope with the truth of what they released and how they let you go. Mm -hmm. There was serious mother wounding in this situation here when it came to these two so that this person cleaved to their friend. This is the same sex connection as well and a lot of that. Yeah, that's what God is telling me. So whatever friend this is, this friend was actually more than just a friend. This is mother wounding. Yep, this person just drowned in their addictions. Everything that they were running from, they, were, they ran straight towards karma. Yep, and they're having to face it. They, they've been trying to avoid it, and they looked at you like you were the problem with why they, why they were going through the things they were going through. They were pointing fingers at you and projecting it at you, but in reality, they were hiding all this behind your back. What is the legal matters here with the reckless sex with this tower? What is this, Father? What is this tower here? Page of Swords. The truth is coming out. Mm-hmm. Oh, Lord have mercy. It's sexual. It's definitely sexual. Whatever the legal matters are, it has to do with sex. Mm-hmm. We got the ace of wands at the bottom of the deck. Whatever it is, it has to do with sex here. Yep. Moving away to want calmer waters. Change your perspective. The truth is coming out. This person is about to be humiliated because whatever they were hiding, this person is now hung, but this is going to change the perspective of a lot of people around this person, about this person. What else is coming out here? Yep, illusion. There was a fog. There was also court case magic and spells and stuff too. This, this person, if they have a sex case over their head, something that had to do with sex, this person kept delaying it with spell work. They were manipulating the situation. Mm-hmm. Um when it comes to the courthouse to keep them out of jail but something's backfiring here was not coming it's not they're not able to um ignore the situation anymore mm -mm. nope what else father with the legal matters yep a third party that's also this this is a third party situation something's not working anymore okay this is financial as well as sexual energy here. So somebody could have got caught up in some type of scandal, some type of trafficking issue, something with um, finances, some type of um, reckless energy here. They were collaborating with people, but they're all falling out the tower. Two people are falling out the tower. There's one person left, which is your person, who is left holding the bag with the legal matters here. So there's something that happened here. They were, were all working together doing this to make money, but it's, it's backfiring. Your person lets sex control them. They could also get some have, have gotten somebody pregnant by sleeping around in the streets, but the person is not it's not their child. Mm mm. No. The tower's blown on that too with paternity in the courthouse. 
if we got paternity i see paternity um cases here i see uh reckless reckless sexual decision the cases from um sexual decisions i see cases for finances something kind of scam type of energy here this person about to do some some of them about to do federal time mm -hmm. and they, they have to tell you this person's about to be imprisoned what's going on here living the living the moment yep a new cycle. This is their new cycle here. This person, their new cycle is karma. Bad luck and karma. That's what's coming their way. This person, is this, a, this is a desperate cry for help. Mm-hmm. This person don't have no money. No, nope, they broke. They deceived their two of cups. We got the ace of pentacles in reverse. And they deceive deception of the two of cups. This person, they this is karma for this person because they turn their back on you. And now the wheel has turned where it looks like that many of you guys, I don't know, I'm not saying the take it how it resonates to you. Um, many of you guys, some of you guys are gonna turn your back on the situation here. What is the turning your back? Yep. Because a lot of you guys already know with the caught. You guys gave this person time to come towards you and tell you the truth, and they kept it. They kept playing with you. Yeah, this person kept. They kept playing and and avoiding the situation here. Mm-hmm. The situation. This person stopped investing. In you guys about to find out why. It has something to do with the person that they were the, that you thought was their friend. Yep, it's a lot of deception here. If you guys were a part of the same um con the same circle, this 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 wingman knows you this wingman lied on you this wingman crossed you you guys were cool with this person too but it was all deception this was right up under your nose this is some serious this part this they, they devalued you but yeah they did this is a, this is a devalued situation it kept, it's coming back to haunt what did i say deception legal deception here and when it comes to children, there's been major deception. Yeah, we got the Three of Pentacles and the Sun in the reverse with the Empress in reverse. Mm-hmm. This person was also deceived by the same people that they trust. So this person's hung in some serious court issues right now. They got a lot on their back. Yeah, they do. And this is a serious sex case, which, which is going to make this person very much humiliated. It's coming back up with the sex offender energy here. Yeah, what did I say? Karma. The devil. This person, they were living in the fast lane and they, they left they left you behind and hurt you for the situation here. And now the tower is falling. The devil has to come collect. A lot of people are about to be caught up in this karma storm here where they can't move because it's, it's time for these cycles to end. You guys have been saying, finally it's coming down. Yes, they, it is. The karma's coming down. But it's not coming down. It's coming down in your justice where you guys get to see the truth. But it's not coming down in the favor of the people that hurt you and did what they did to you. It's coming down worse than what they even expected. They never expected for it to come down this heavy. No. It did not. And you got, a lot of you got, like I said, Cherry, a lot of you guys already know about the truth. Your new cycle will be, you'll be moving on with somebody else, with a new boo. That's what's going on here. You guys are about to have a choice between two, but this person has made, has made a bed that they can, that's, that's hard for them to lie in. They're going through some serious karma. They're under judgment heavy because this person, they, if you guys are twins, they made it very bad for themselves by constantly, this person was constantly devaluing you, um, refusing to stop deceiving the connection refusing to move forward refusing to let it go this person they left queen, queen of pentacles in reverse this that stopped investing in you guys were supposed to be married uh-huh but they were deceived whoever this that this whole witch this jezebel energy here deceived them and they were working with somebody else the, the friend this keep coming up and the karma their karma is to be tied to the devil with the tower this is coming down ugly yeah. This person was played. Uh, this came out probably about six months to a year ago. And when it comes to the setup here, mm -hmm, if this is like everything. And once it's like a spiral out of a spiral, down spiral, 
Uh-huh. Everything coming out. This person did not commit to you. They did not value. They mistreated you. With them doing that and when they, whenever they hurt you, they left you in your head. They did not apologize. They did not bring justice. This person refused to. They didn't even say goodbye in some cases. This person just vamped and, and erased you from their life. They went towards something here. This horror witch and whoever this wingman is were also working together against this person. This wing, this, kar this karmic is the, the father of this baby, the deception, and it's the third party situation here. It's this karmic connection, which is the both people. The karmic that they chose over you and the, uh, the other person, the man, the friend. <laughs> Those two have babies together. Your person been taking care of the babies. Is this about to come out in the court? Yeah. Whatever corruption that they've been doing together, they put it on it. They have it where your person is tied to it. Mm hmm. They work together to set this plan up on this person. The longer that you stay holding on to your karma, the worse that it comes out. It does not come out in your favor. Your karma will never leave you. You're supposed to release your karma. And whatever that this person did you dirty, if they left you for, for in the will of fortune, they left you financially strapped, they left you stuck in your head, they left you outside, acted like they didn't know you, abandoned you any, in any type of way, and mistreated you and slandered you and lied about you or anything like that, which it looked like they did, this, is, this will is coming back. This person had a judgment to make. They made the wrong judgment. They, they chose the devil over their twin flame connection or divine partnership. And the wheel is turning. This person needs you so bad right now. Mm-hmm. But they just been, they've been nothing but deceptive towards you with the five of swords. This person kept deceiving you. They were one up in you behind your back and you had no idea. Yeah, what's the what's the uh, wheel of fortune? Yeah, what did I say? You guys deserve happiness. You guys are moving towards happiness here. Yep, Ten of Cups. So a lot of these people here will be losing you. Yeah, some of you guys will be with that person. Or some of you guys may stay single for a little bit. Depending on your situation. But when it comes down to this situation here, this person's life is blowing the F up. And it's falling. There's no money here. There's a lot of um, attachments and entities here. There's a lot of destruction in this situation. There's a lot of betrayal in this situation. This person tied themselves to the devil. And they were in love with you the whole time. And now they effed up on the situation because now they know who you are. They want to rush towards you. But this person's scared and terrified to tell you the absolute raw, uncutting truth. They feel like it's going to be the final nail in the coffin. This is a hit for some of you guys. So we're all doing different things in our on our journeys. This person should have just been honest from the beginning. Yeah, they should have been honest. Yeah, they should have been honest. This person, they left you single. You guys are successful too. Mm -hmm. They play. They didn't. They, this person didn't invest in you at first. They thought you that you did not have the money. This person was very focused on finances. They were very much shallow. Uh huh. It could have been looks that they didn't want. They didn't want think that you looked a certain way, or they thought you were some type of whore or something. They thought you were out in the street. They thought you were broke. Thought you were a user. This person was chasing after things they could not see off the tip of their nose, and they believed in these friends. And the people that they were working with in this type of connection here when it comes down to the corruption of this of these legal matters. Yeah, now this person's left holding the bag. There was a lot of sexual deviance going on here when it comes to the devil. Mm -hmm. A lot of deception. This person left you. They deceived you. And they, they, they walked around carrying a burden instead of healing the situation with you. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah, what did I say? They're sitting back watching you and trapped in their head, stuck, and don't know how to come back towards you. Yep, this person, they are watching you and they ready, they want to walk away from whatever they went towards. To come back towards you, this person want to make it right with you. This is really heavy energy. This person did a lot. And when they walked away from you, you guys had eight cups invested. And they lied on the connection like you like they didn't have anything with you. Like you were just someone who was after them and their their looks or their sex or um, what they had to offer. You were sweating them. And you would have never had a chance with them. 
Mm-hmm. When I say it's something deceptive, something that they did recklessly sexual, and it has something to do, could be somebody underage as well that they were dealing with. Yep, a case that they were dealing with here. This person had a sex addiction, very reckless one, but it, it came from entity attachments from whoever they were dealing with. The tower is going to blow on that with the truth is going to illuminate who they chose over you. Mm-hmm. This person gonna, this person going to feel like a major fool. They were played. They were lied to by their friends and the people, that the person that they were laying next to every night. Mm-hmm. Yep. The perspective is their perspective is changing now because of everything they're going through. Yeah, and everybody around them is saying who they are too. Yeah, the community that they were in. Look, Eight of Wands here. The devil is, is hitting hard. The stuff is coming down quickly. Yeah, it is. Because what? The magic is in reverse. They owe the devil a debt. And their debt, their, their debt may be their karma to lose you. Because the debt of the devil here, the devil coming in heavy with karma, with the judgment. They owe the devil a heavy debt here. This person was doing some serious underhanded dark dark issues. This person was messing with the devil. They, they, they clung to the devil. And if they're twin flame, you can't do that. The twin flame is connection is a Lord, is a, a high honor Lord God connection. That's what God put together. Whew, Lord have mercy. There's a lot of blood in this situation. A lot of broken hearts about to come up in this situation here, though. A lot of lies. A lot of spill work going back. This person wants you back so bad. Mm, they do. <coughs> Give me one bottom energy, Father, before we get out of here. If they want to come out of rest and move towards you and tell you the truth. Yep. They want to drop everything and come towards you. And tell you the truth. In one final energy, one clear energy, Father. They're still juggling. Some people are still juggling. They could still have hidden lovers. Yep, point of cup. Stay in love with you. I love you. I love this person misses you very much. They miss you a lot. Mm-hmm. This person they went through they they're going through some serious rough a rough situation around here. Mm-hmm. Give me some more, Father. What's going on in this situation here? Yep. The whoever they left you for is watching you too. They know your person's in love with you. Mm-hmm. This person don't care. They want this person just to be away from you. Whatever they gotta do to keep you guys separated. There's some messages of concern coming through about the situation here. This person's very nervous and scared about telling you about whatever this is that happened sexually. Uh-huh. This person got some serious sexual trauma. Yeah, but there's something very much sexual that's going on here with this with this uh, reckless sex and the Knight of Wands in reverse. That's reckless. We got reckless sex twice. The Knight of Wands in reverse, and that's a, that's a young that's a younger person. Yep, but it was due, due to entity attachments. Yes, it was community in reverse. The community is looking at this person. They're shunning them now. Mm-hmm. Yep, with this tower falling, everybody's turning their back on them. Courtship. This person wants to communicate with you and come towards you, but they courted the devil. They chose the devil over their court, over their connection. They owe the devil a serious debt here. They do. You guys have beautiful gifts coming in. Mm hmm Yes, you do. Got beautiful things coming in towards you. This person's in deep despair. Yep. Stay afraid of this is the end. What did I say? The nail in the coffin. Look at God. The nail in the coffin. Goodbye. This is what this person is afraid of. This is why, but they've been holding back. And when, while they've been holding back, they made it worse. Mm hmm. They should have just been honest with you. This person has been in love with you. And the reason why this person never had been in love before. So what they did was, um, this situation about to end ugly for all of these people involved. Mm -hmm. This karmic may be going to jail or passing away too. Mm -hmm. It's part poverty. It's part of, these people are losing everything because everything was stolen here. This person's concerned that you don't love them anymore too. They're afraid of you rejecting them and not giving them the love that, that they what they wish for you. Yeah, this person's concerned because if they lose you, they lose everything. Yep, poverty. If this situation ends, this person is, is broke. They're done financially. 
I don't care who they deal with. They're going to always have it. They're going to they're gonna live in an impoverished lifestyle. Robbing Peter to pay Paul. Getting themselves tied up in jail again. This is a cycle this person has been playing for, for several lifetimes, and their ego has cost them this downward spiral. So if, the, if you guys do not let this person back, this person is very much nervous and paranoid. They could already be out in poverty, losing a lot, or homeless, or about to be. This person, they cry a lot. They're very much afraid of what you're going to say because they, they now know your value. They know how much they love you, and they're afraid of losing you. This person thought life was a game, and they're about to find, they find out the hard way it was not. Commit child in reverse. The community, if you guys have, if the, the community, the community has changed their perspective on this person. Because if you guys have this specifically for those who have kids, if you guys have children by this person, this person lied and said that you were not the mother of their children, that you were lying about their baby, having babies with them, that you were lying about the kid. The community now knows the truth. They have changed their perspective about the situation here. That they know the truth. Yep, this person, they knew who you were, but they still rejected you. The love in reverse. This person held back. Yeah. They held back. Courthouse. This person's in despair. Because the, the whatever mag this person was actually using magic, court case spells, to keep to stop them from getting in trouble. Mm-hmm. It's back it's, it's backfiring. They're forced to face everything here. And this person went that they went towards they said something's ending. So the connection that they went towards and chose over you is also going through an ending. If they commit to this person, they're going through a divorce. This person is going to be in a lot of pain in the courthouse because they're about to find about a lot when it comes to this connection that they could tie themselves to. Yep. What did I say? Her honor is shutting it down. It's coming through here. There's about to be a change here. The situation is shifting. Yep, it's all coming down. Give me a little bit more. Whew, Jesus, Lord have mercy. This is bad. Yep, fed the F up. This person's fed up. They want to tell the truth, but they're afraid of the ending. This person's afraid. They're scared that you're going to be done. Mm -hmm. Once you know. Divine feminine, they, they're afraid they're about to lose you. They're concerned they're about to lose you. Yep, because they gambled you for a karmic, for a karmic um, party, th a third karmic third party un unlearned lessons and toxic energy here. The community knows the truth. This person was ice cold to you. They don't want to be that way anymore. This person treated you bad. Yeah, they did. Yep, what did I say? This person just wanted to f. They treated you like you were just something to do. What did I say? And every time they came towards you, they came towards you in this energy. Like they just want to screw. Yep. Look, X. Yep. This person's miserable. There's no peace in the situation that they're in. This person can't find any peace. Look, what did I say? Twin flame done. If you guys are done with this connection, if you divine feminine, leave this masculine outside. This mask is done for, okay? As far as financially, there will be nothing here. This masculine will not have anything coming because you're walking away with everything. This person played a lot of games with you. Mm -hmm. They were petty and mean and gossiped and lied. They gave up on you and let you go. They abandoned children too if you guys have killed kids for a karmic lesson. And now the kids are not there. That's their lesson they had to learn. Yep. What did I say? They, left, they could have left you because somebody was pregnant. Or somebody could be pregnant right now and it's not theirs. Yep. Bully. This person bullied you and treated you just like you were just something to do. And they stay stubborn, refusing to change. <coughs> and now God it has the, the divine union up in the air. Don't know how it's going to go because God, is, in, God is, is giving you the final decision. Uh, but he has the last say so when it comes to how this all comes down. Okay. Let's give me one more so before we get out of here. Yep, secretive, sneaky, mysterious, hiding information. This person was hiding a lot. They kept hiding information from you. And it's about to come out. Mm-hmm. They hear so much from you. Thinking about you, crying, nostalgic, and missing you. They're having a hard time. Because everything that they thought was real is falling. Mm-hmm. 
Everybody turning on this person. Caught red-handed secrets exposed. What did I say? All their business out in the street. I, it's already out in the community that you guys were in. Everything's already out in the situation here. Passion coming into union chemistry missing you. This person's missing you guys. More no final energy. More no final energy, Father. This stuff was flying. Soul contract. Yep. Soulmate partnership spiritual union. This is a show definitely a divine connection. Y'all got decisions to make. You do. On that note. Whew. This is about to be heavy. Yeah. It's not going to I'm going to tell you guys something too. It's not going to come in until you're ready. Yeah, this person snooping they watching you too. Mhm. Mm Drive by stalking social media psychic tarot readings. Some of them getting tarot readings like crazy trying to figure out um what to say but you can't do that. When like I tell you guys all the time when people are looking for tarot readers for answers where with me i'm not a reader i'm a spiritual teacher and a high priestess of a divine feminine as well as an empress high priestess prophetess okay so i'm different i give my messages from god and a lot of people they want but they, they don't believe me in the beginning and they always end up coming back like dag i'm sorry i didn't believe you but this is what happened you don't have to believe me it's, it's not coming from me okay um everything i do here is for your highest good whether you like it or not whether it triggers you or not it's for your highest good it's for you to heal and only way to only way through it is to feel it you know and to be honest that's how you get past things somebody wanted to live in a fairy tale land here and they did not want to face the truth so they got rid of what they knew was the truth which was you and they thought that they could live this life and keep it going where it will last until they were through, you know, and it's backfiring mm -hmm. because of how they handle you. They bullied you. They were mean to you. This person, they iced you out. They were cold. They were callous. And because they were hiding something from you, not because of what, anything you did. It's because of what they, what they were hiding from you. And that's why Lord God is like, no, no more. It's all coming down. And now this person stuck in their head and trapped in their head, effed up over you and worried about goodbye. Mm-hmm. Once you find out what this what this information is that they're about to release, so you guys just be prepared. Um, it's not it's not gonna come in when you can handle it, cause God puts no more than you can bear. So just be aware, it's coming towards you. Yeah, we're gonna take this over to the second premiere. Um, if you have any questions about anything, just email me. We have two questions for fifteen dollars. If you guys um, need the ASAP, add $10 to that, and I'll get it to you within 48 to 72 hours. We have two special readings on sale until the, 30, until the last day of the month at 11.59 p.m. You have the eight questions, which is, you can they're optional. You can do it as a guidance if you want me to freestyle it. It's on sale for $55 this month. And then we have the um, spiritual warfare. Um, it's on special for $65 this month, regular price $77.77. Both of them are very good deals. Um, it'll give, the eight questions will give you the clarity that you need because you can ask me anything. And I'll ask God and he'll let me know what to tell you, okay? Um, so that's a really good one that's on sale right now too, okay? Um, if you guys need me, just email me. My PayPal and Cash App are below. If you have any questions about anything, just email me. You need a payment plan? Email me. If you need to sign up for something and you can't, you don't know, you can't find it, email me. Okay. Um, if you like to send tokens for the channel, my email, my, my PayPal and Cash App are below. Thank you guys in advance for any super chats that you sent as well. Um, I thank you guys for everything. I do. These towers are coming in heavy. We got eclipses coming in. We got all type of transits going on. It's about to go down here. And we're about, we're coming into uh, when Scorpio season hit, it's about to get crazy. Because, you know, it's just, that's the season of death. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes, it is. That's what we got here. Let's take it on over to the other side. I'm just, this energy heavy, y'all. I want y'all to understand how heavy this is. This is a twin flame connection. And there's about to be a serious plot twist here. Because you guys have a soulmate too. Mm-hmm. Some of these people have messed up. They threw away. They, they played with it. Now they're stalking it. Mm-hmm. This person, they, they sat back watching. 
the connection but never did nothing. They were they they were not determined. They were they were so selfish to stay stuck in their wounding and chase their karma. And now they gotta sit in it. A lot of them about to end up sitting in their karma and losing the best thing ever happened to them. For them sitting still and playing around. It's all blowing up. Yep, they burning up right in their karma. That's what we got here. I love you and I'll talk to you guys soon. Let's get on to the second second premiere. Namaste.